Welcome to Building Recommendation Engines, Part 1 by Suresh Kumar Gorakala, a video course by Pact Publishing. I'm Mark Thomas and I'll be Suresh's voice for this course. Suresh Kumar Gorakala is a data scientist focused on artificial intelligence. He has almost 10 years of professional experience having worked with various global clients across multiple domains and helped them in solving their business problems using advanced big data analytics. He has extensively worked on recommendation engines, natural language processing, advanced machine learning, and graph databases. He previously co-authored Building a Recommendation System for R with Pact Publishing. He is a passionate traveler and is a photographer by hobby. OK, let's talk about recommendation engines. A recommendation engine, sometimes referred to as a recommender system, is a tool that lets algorithm developers predict what a user may or may not like amongst a list of given items. Recommender systems have become extremely common in recent years and are applied in a variety of applications. The most popular ones are movies, music, news, books, research articles, search queries, social tags and products in general. This video starts with an introduction to recommendation systems and its applications. You'll then start building recommendation engines straight away from the very basics. As you move along, you'll learn to build recommender systems with popular frameworks such as R, Python, and more. You'll get an insight into the pros and cons of different recommendation engines and when to use which recommendation. You'll learn to use GitHub to push code and commit changes using Git. Moving on, you'll understand the basics of configuration management and the architecture of DevOps. You'll see how to take care of deploying the code into our new shiny servers. Then we'll explore monitoring and various solutions to the range of problems we might face. With the help of this course, you'll quickly get up and running with recommender systems. You'll create recommendation engines of varying complexities, ranging from a simple recommendation engine to real-time recommendation engines. Now let's look at our course. We'll start from scratch providing insights into recommender systems. The introductory section would be a refresher to the data scientists and introduction to the beginners of recommendation engines. This introductory section will introduce popular recommendation engines that people use in their day-to-day -day lives. Popular recommendation engine approaches available along with their pros and cons are covered. The next section, which is a basic implementation of how to build a movie recommendation engine, to give a head start for us before we take off into the world of recommendation engines. Now, in the next section, we'll see the different recommendation engine techniques popularly employed, such as user-based collaborative filtering in recommendation engines, item-based collaborative filtering, content-based recommendation engines, context-aware recommenders, hybrid recommenders, model-based recommender systems using machine learning models, and mathematical models. Next, we'll see the various machine learning techniques used in building recommendation engines, such as similarity measures, classification, regression, dimension reduction techniques. This section also includes evaluation metrics to test the recommendation engine's predictive power. Finally, we'll learn about how to build user-based collaborative filtering and item-based collaborative filtering in R and Python. We'll also learn about different libraries available in R and Python that are extensively used in building recommendation engines. In part two, we'll learn about building real-time recommendation engines with Spark, Neo4j, and Mahout. This video is a step-by-step -step practical tutorial that shows you the basics of recommendation engines in a practical way. This comprehensive tutorial caters to beginner data analysts, data science professionals, or anyone looking to understand and build decision-making systems and recommendation engines and want a project-based guide to do so. So what are we waiting for? Let's begin this journey together and I hope you enjoy the ride.